Being queer in this age is almost refreshing. We as a society have finally come around to starting to accept people for being themselves. Being queer in this age is almost refreshing, almost relieving, almost. Mm. Queerness tastes of the blood shed by those sla slaughtered in the name of religion. It tastes of the dirt that makes its way into my mouth when I am pushed to the ground. It tastes of sourness and shame, yet it tastes as sweet as his lips and his skin. It tastes of a taste for which I am willing to die. Mm. Being queer sounds of slurs and sin, spouted from the sore throats of the bigots, perched on the side of the road like hawks, no vultures, <laughs> whose voices are too hoarse to keep spitting poison at me as I walk by. It sounds of every single song that's made for him and her. It sounds of a family asking their little girl if she has a boyfriend. It is the screaming silence after the sigh that escapes their mouths when she reminds them that her boyfriend is a girl. It's, it looks like second glances, it looks like staring, it looks like a rainbow bursting in every color, every sexuality, every gender. It looks like the flag that we fly in our hearts. Gay, lesbian, bisexual, pansexual, asexual, aromantic, demisexual, demi-boy, demi-girl, transgender, agender, bigender, gender fluid, gender queer. It also looks like the black and white of heteronormativity, of heteronormativity, of cisnormativity. Mm. The black and white on the prison uniforms forced onto us just for being ourselves. Mm. It can never just be black on black or white on white because that's too hard to see, because opposites belong together, because that's not what God intended, wasn't it? Mm. Being queer feels like a punch, a slap, a kick from the house just for being yourself. It is painful and stinging and the hurt lingers when we are told to keep hiding. And the loss of trust when we when they say that it's a phase and that we'll regret this. Mm. It feels like the ache in the back of my head when anyone calls me a girl, and it feels like the rush I get in the way my fingertips tingle when someone mistakes me for a boy. Mm. <laughs> I am neither, but I am also both. I am gender fluid, god damn it, and don't tell me that I'm confused because I know what I am. Yeah. It feels like waking up in the wrong skin. It feels like the sickness that takes over my body when I look in the mirror and I see a body that I was happy with one day and disgusted with the next. Oh. It hurts so much, but it feels so good when somebody tells me that I'm valid. Yes! It smells of iron, blood, gunpowder, a war, a war on gender, a war on sexuality, a war on us. It smells of a war that we are occurring to fight, or that we are currently fighting just to stay alive, to keep our jobs, to keep our sanity, to keep our humanity. It smells of sex and sweat and you and your breath and the welcoming scent of your clothes and everything that I could ever want. It smells like the mothballs in my closet, but at least it smells like home. Oh!